All right, so after you download the Gemstone Lite app from the App Store or Google Play, when you open up, you'll see something similar to this. Now, as you can see on mine, I have side door light and Matt's house. Um, that little logo next to Matt's house is the Gemstone logo. I also have a light bulb, So, but you, unless you ordered a light bulb, you won't have a light bulb there. So it'll just say either your house or it'll say your last name. And then this little toggle switch, just so you know, is just a quick way to turn it on or off. Um, when you turn it on, it turns on to the last uh, setting that you had on to the house. So you want to go ahead and click where it has the logo that says either your last name or your house. And you click that, and what you'll see is it says faves, which is short for favorites, and then a plus sign. So you click favorites, there's nothing here because it's brand new setup. So what I like to do first is hit this plus sign here on this, and then you can choose any icon that you want for your folder image. I'm just going to go ahead and click the Superman one. Click save, and I'm going to label this Matt's Customs, and then click confirm. So this is where I will make all my own custom settings. Um, so I'm going to click on it, uh, and I would hit plus sign, and I would choose it from here. So here, up here where it says unname, you would name it. We'll call this one red and green. Um, the next line down is this right here, this little drop down arrow. The three solid bars is just static, and then the other ones are different forms of motion and animation. Um, next to it is the arrow, and that is the the direction you want the animation to travel. You can go left to right, right to left, uh, meet in the middle, go both ways, etc. Uh, background color. Now the background color only matters when you have animation that has dead spots. So like, for instance, if you do the Pac-Man or the ghosts, those lights chase each other. So some lights will not be. So let me just do this. So say we want if one's red and one's green and they're chasing each other, the dead lights in that animation would be what the background color is. So you click background color and you can set it to what you want. But first you have to do down here, you see a plus sign. When you click that, that does one. So right now it turned green. So what that would do if I hit save would make the entire house just green. But we don't want red, or we want red and green. So now click the second plus sign and it made another form of green. I'm just going to click that again. Now I'm going to choose red. You can choose it on the color wheel or you can choose it on the little swatches down below. So right there what would happen is it would go green, red, and then it would go the whole distance of your home. So it would alternate green, red, green, red, green, red. Uh, or you can do, you know, you can add more than that. So say we want to double. So we just click the colors we want to change. And then you'd have two greens, two reds throughout the whole entire thing. And say I want to do Pac-Man, I would just choose that. And then you could choose the background color for that animation. So if I wanted it blue or white or whatever color you want you can use the wheel uh, for your background color and then you would hit save so that would be red and green with the pac uh, pac-man animation so you see that star next to it now if i click that it turns yellow and all that does is puts it into the favorite folder that is something that uh, you are going to utilize because there are so many different options when you when you find one that you really like you star it and just make it much easier to find so now I'm going to show you down at the bottom here, you have static, custom, timer, download, and setting. So for static, it's simply, you can turn it on, and it's just one color wheel. And if you click the color down here and long press it, it brings up not only the color wheel, but you can do it by percentage here. The, so if you have it at 100 red, 100 green, 100 blue, 100 white, and 100 bright, that is the brightest the system can get. That is the truest bright white there is. And that's um, that's really good when you want to have it really illuminated outside, having a party, or just want to see at night. Um, so that's static. Again, you can go on there off with that. Custom, I'm going to go over in a different video. Uh, but it's just customizing by the light bulb. And then this is the one I really want to show you down here. It says download. So... This is talking about all like the preset stuff that you see, the Christmas, the sports teams. So you'll see a bunch of different options here. So I'm just going to click on holiday, and I'm going to download Christmas, uh, Christmas 2. And sometimes, you know, it, it's it's downloading it from the cloud, so it can take, it'll take a minute or so. Um, 
And I noticed that when I did Christmas, it didn't it didn't work right. So I'm going to go back to Matt's house and see how it, now it only says Christmas 2. So I'm glad it showed that. Sometimes this does happen. So what you do, because we didn't get Christmas 1, come back to the download uh, section of there. Click on Holiday where it says Christmas. Just hold it and slide to the left and hit Remove File. And then hit Install again. And that should install it correctly. So if that ever happens where, say, you download a... You know, you want to do um, NFL teams, you know, you can install it, or NBA. Now, you don't have to download all every single folder in here, but you're obviously more than welcome to. It is fun to play around and really find out um, what you like. I found some of the NFL and M NBA teams. I just really like the colors, even though I'm not personally into sports. I like the color schemes. So it's nice that they're just all pre-installed with different colors and, and sequences. So then when you come back to your main Matt's house screen, so, well, yours, yours will say your last name or your first name, but, so if I click Christmas 2, these are all the preset ones. Um, some are, again, the three bars represent static, right? right. And um, in Christmas 2, Toffee Sparkle is awesome, so I recommend checking that out. You're going to love it. Uh, anyway, and so is Tropical Candy, all of these. So anyway, you so all these, you can just, you know, if you just click it, I, can, I know you can't see my finger, but I'm just tapping it. I'm tapping Christmas fruit. I'm tapping blue shine. That'll change the lights on your house. And that is the basic rundown of how to create and how to utilize folders. Now, if you want to change, say you, it's not, it's Matt's Customs, you want to change it, just long press on it. You can either delete it or edit it. And so you can change, you know, the icon or the name. All right.